Hey what's up everybody I hope you all are doing absolutely fine this is Rudra Ditya and in this video I am going to talk about the Oxygen OS 11 open beta 1 update well I will tell you all the new features and also I will tell you that how to download but I will highly recommend you not to download this if you are using your mobile as your daily driver then definitely don't upgrade to this version because maybe you will find some bugs so that's why i won't recommend you to uh, just rush and uh, just download this update wait for the final release and then you can download but in this video you can definitely see all the features so first thing first we will see that how you can download this so i already downloaded the file which you can see here and you will get the link in the description box from where you can download this file so first thing you have to do is to rename this file remove that jar thing and then you are good to go now the second step is you have to copy this into your internal storage of your phone so i copied this and now i will click internal storage and then you just have to paste it make sure that you don't choose any folders you simply have to paste it and then the file will appear in the bottom of the list so here is our zip file as you can see now the third step is you have to go into the system then you have to select system update and then you have to click on the gear icon here and then you have to go to the local upgrade and you can see that the file appeared here so now you have to click on that and then hit install now and you are good to go once the installation process get over you need to reboot your device to install the android 11 version and make sure that your battery level of your device is above 30 percent and a minimum of 3 gb storage space is available before installing this update so please keep that in mind all right guys now let's see the new features and the new user interface of oxygen os 11 and i will show you the screenshots of oxygen os 10 side by side so you can differentiate more and here is the first thing which is the app drawer so you can see and then you will see the notification set and you will notice that there is a quite noticeable difference between both of them now there is a new settings panel inspired by one ui we can say like that they for they focus more on one hand users and then even the about phone interface changed a lot as you can see so yeah it's changed a lot so you can definitely see and if we talk about the new features then the first feature which we get is the dark mode toggle option in the notification set now we can directly switch to dark mode from the notification panel or we can convert our phone into the light mode so this is very convenient because earlier in oxygen os 10 this process was very lengthy you can see by yourself so suppose that you want to change your phone sim from light mode to dark mode in oxygen os 10 then you have to go into the settings then customization then preset theme you have to do all this process just to change your phone's theme and that was very annoying and i am so glad that they finally give the dark mode toggle in oxygen os 11 which was way more convenient than doing this process now moving towards the second feature then we get always on display finally in all the oneplus nord devices which have oxygen os 11 so you will get a few of them like 10 clock styles as of now and you can save them but make sure that if you just only save them that will not work like all the time you need to go into the display setting and then you need to go in ambient display and then select always on ambient display and then select all day now if you turn off your phone you can see that always on display is working all the time well you will also get a new canvas mode in which you can select any of your photos and then that photo will change into canvas painting and then you can select the photo as your always on display which is a very cool feature and i seriously like this new canvas mode and i am 100 percent sure that you guys also going to enjoy this feature a lot and a huge thumbs up from my side well talking about more changes in user interface then you will notice the changes in weather application here you can see side by side then if you talk about the calculator application then you will get some few changes 
and an alarm application as well especially while setting up the alarm you will get some different layouts so yeah this is the thing but now let's talk about the oneplus dialer yes you can install the oneplus dialer in oxygen os 11 and it's working absolutely fine now this is a huge relief for all of us because nobody wants that google dialer especially in oneplus phones and now you can record call without any annoying prompts well once you download this you can set this i mean you have to set this as default phone app select oneplus phone and then set as default and not only that now you will also get the option of auto call recording options so first you have to go into the settings then call recording and then you can enable this option which is call auto recording and then you are good to go so thumbs up congratulations to all the oneplus nord users or any oneplus users who are on oxygen os 11 or you can wait in future you will get this and then you can record all your calls all right now if we talk about the gallery interface then you will see an entirely changed user interface of gallery now here is an explore page here is the collections and in explore page you can see your photos and videos as in form of a story which is good and then if you talk about the collection tab then it's basically your photos folder and photos is simple where you will click all your photos i mean this is the place where your photos will appear and then you will get some new camera interface as well so yeah it's a different ui but with the same features you will not get any extra features but definitely i'm looking forward to compare the camera of oxygen os 11 and oxygen os 10 to see that is there any improvement or not in the oxygen os 11 so if you want to make me a video on this topic do let me know in the comment box below all right now let's talk about the main topic of today's video which is the display tint issue in oxygen os 11 then i am surprised and for now the display i mean the tint isn't appeared here in my testing but if i will encounter in future i will definitely update you on my twitter so make sure to follow me on twitter but i tested at different brightness levels in pitch black in pitch dark condition and yes definitely the tint isn't appeared and it was very little very little which is hard to notice so we can't complain oneplus did a good job and they haven't mentioned anything about the tint but definitely they fixed this i guess almost not completely but almost and now i can guarantee you that this will not affect your day-to-day -day uses or even if you go to check in incognito mode it will not affect you even in some dark apps where you can see in apps like geo seven and spotify you can't encounter the tint all right guys so that's it from today's video i hope this is helpful for you and also you guys enjoyed the video if you then smash the like button and also share this video as much as you can and if you are new here then make sure to subscribe my channel and turn on bell notifications so that you will get all the notifications of my videos and i'm going to upload a lot of oneplus nord related videos and some interesting interesting contents are coming very soon so make sure to subscribe my channel and i will see you very soon in my next video until then, bye-bye, take care.